After seeing a homeless woman carrying her child in the rain, she thought there must be something she could do to help. Her gifts come straight from the heart and with a lot of elbow grease. And prepare for a wild weekend. In fact, things are going to get so crazy around here, we're not even quite sure what color to put on top the weather tower tonight. <laughs> <laughs> this is News 10 at 11. Well, during the holiday season, many of us think of ways to give to help people in need. Well, tonight, News 10's Dana Howard introduces us to one woman who has an unusual gift that she gives year-round to families whose needs are critical. <laughs> Yeah, her hands have seen their days. <laughs> Still, they might as well be the hands of an angel at work, taking broken down, oh, used yeah. and filthy Very strollers. Terrible. terrible, but it's about the way they are. Disassembling them, cleaning them, piece by piece. Now I have to get this part off. And then reassembling them into a clean, temporary shelter for a small child who has a mother who has no home. When they're camping on the river, they have a nice stroller to keep the baby up off the ground. So Rebecca Young keeps working, cleaning, never able to forget the faces she sees at Mary House, a daytime shelter for women. They are the faces that started her on this mission. When I saw mothers carrying their babies around in the rain, I thought, I must be able to do something. So that's when I started gathering up strollers. And when each stroller is cleaned to perfection, Rebecca brings them here to Mary House, where she has delivered them every Thursday, every week, like clockwork, for the past 11 years. And when you add that up, Rebecca has put nearly 600 homeless children in strollers. Come here, puppy. Two-year-old Jonathan's mother received this week's stroller. To me, it's like a Cadillac, because like I said, I'm carrying my son, who's 33 pounds. So I was just really happy to get a stroller. This is where they usually end up putting their little faces right on there. One more cleaned and ready to go. And Rebecca, she keeps going for the mothers who have no home and for their children who are not at fault. So they walk, these little tiny people. And it's hard. In Sacramento, Dana Howard, News 10. Well, Rebecca taught herself how to repair those strollers. She pays for them out of her own pocket as well, sifting through yard sales and thrift stores to find ones that are affordable. Thank it's, goodness it's for just, people like that. It's yeah. amazing. It is. She's wow. a saint. It's just. Thank you, Rebecca. Thank you. She's amazing. Oh, How many boy. storms are headed this yeah, way? Yeah, like what do we got? Like two, three lined you know, up there? I've been in California over five years, <laughs> and it is rare for a day to.